All right, I guess this is a vlog that I've decided to do or whatever and didn't decide it until I was in the car, but uh, I'm visiting Hobby Town, USA at the recommendation of Stud Sidious. Also might visit a Lego store if I don't find anything good at Hobby Town, but let's see what's in. Okay, that was quick. Not only did they not have any Lego I was interested in, they didn't have any Lego at all. It was just a lot of model car stuff and a few other little things. Did spot some off-brand Lego. But uh, I'm gonna visit a Lego store next, see if they've got good pab. If they don't, I'm probably going to visit another Hobby Town. So nothing good on the pab wall, the Lego store, so I'm gonna head over to a different Hobby Town, see if I have better luck there than at the last one. If there's nothing, then I'm gonna head over to another Lego store. Okay, slight detour. I've decided to stop at Walmart to see if they have the May 4th store display out. If they do, I'm going to attempt another executive purchase. Probably not going to be successful, but you never know. Also going to see if they have anything good for clearance. Okay, so no May 4th display in that Walmart, which is a good thing in my opinion, because at least they can figure out when to put things out. Uh, as you saw in that footage, there were quite a few sets, including a lot of justifiers, but uh, nothing I was really interested in. So we're gonna head on over to Hobby Town. Okay, so Hobby Town had a few things, as you guys saw. They had the Indiana Jones sets, a bunch of the fighter plane chase. So, if you're near Northbrook, Illinois, and you haven't been able to find the Indiana Jones sets, Hobby Town's the place to stop. Uh, they had a few other older sets, as you saw, generous or buildable figures, and a few other buildable figures. But nothing I was really interested in, so I'm gonna hit up the Lego store next. Lego store was a success, got a pad bag because you get the discount if you don't pay for the silly little plastic cup. I uh, looked around in there a little bit, no BTS set, that's bad news for Brick Hive. But uh, nothing else I'm really interested in, not really going to go to any other stores, just going to call it a day and head back home. Alright, I have returned home, got the pad bag here, I'm going to go through it to show you guys all the parts that I got. Okay, so that took a little while, but all the pad has been sorted. Got some bigger parts over here. Got a few of these since I used up so many in the Temple of Fortitude. Some other bigger parts. They finally had the doors and the frames at the same time, so I got one. A few big miscellaneous pieces back here. A couple cash registers. Some uh, bigger bricks and plates, at least big for this hall. Uh, white tiles here, some 1x3 plates. I'm actually, that drawer is getting full. The 1x3 drawer, I might have to expand it to two. 1x4 plates in black, some 1x2 plates. Uh, I, I picked up a few of these in my last pad haul, but wanted to get some more. Some bracket pieces, some snot pieces, as well as these, these jumpers. Figured these would be useful. Uh, grills, couldn't hurt to get a few of these since they break sometimes. Uh, a few of these and these. Uh, these I found were good detail for my Temple of Fortitude mock, so I bought some in white. Uh, these one by one glitter bricks. Not sure what I'm going to use them for, but I have them to find out. Over here, one by one tan plates, good for detail. Some flowers, also good for detail. These one by one, I guess you call them like roof pieces, I suppose, in orange. Interesting detail piece. One by one round plates with a hole in the middle. And a lot of one by one sand blue tiles. Uh, this, you know, looks like a lot, but I have a feeling it wouldn't cover a whole lot of surface area. 
And I'm not quite sure what I'd use these for, but I wanted them so I can find out. But uh, yeah, that's gonna be pretty much it for this vlog in Pab Hall, if that's what I'm calling it. Might become a series, might do this every once in a while. Never know, but uh, thank you all for watching. Uh, feel free to like and comment down below, and I'll catch you all in the next video.